Hi everybody, this is Cheryl here. I'm gonna do a what's on my nails video. I just um, did my nails and um, I'll show you what I used. Um, I used my, and this is available in my store. This is my um, UNC Professional Purple Monomer. Um, this is the four ounce size. Um, I also used my, um, this is my glow, um, ice shimmer and it's, uh, you can, I've been using it a lot lately. It's this right here. It glows blue. It's an ice shimmer powder and, um, this is in my store as well. And what I did was the mix that I made today for Nail Oracle's um, 150 Subby giveaway, the Seafoam Breeze. I actually used that on my nails too. And I mixed it up in some acrylic. And um, what I used for a, a primer is I used the ASP acidless primer and this stuff really does a really good job um keeping my my nails on and then i use the asp top coat and i had a question where i told people in one of my videos i asked you guys what to do because what was happening is it was peeling off after 24 hours i could peel it like in one peel and I went to Sally's because that's where I bought it. And I told them about it. And they said, well, what probably happened was it, um, she said sometimes in the shipping process, the, the lids aren't very tight and they like partially cure. And so what I, she wants me to do is take the two bottles that I bought back and she's going to exchange them for me. So hopefully that works. But for now I used it and we'll see. It'll probably peel off by morning. Um, and I use my number 14 um, Grumbracker brush, which I love. <laughs> so anyway, um, and again, with my cuticles being all red, I'm sorry about that. And it's not because of my drill. It's because of this thing. When I buff my nails, I'm just, I don't know, I'm very, I'm a very impatient person. So I just don't... <laughs> I just go, I just go nuts. So yeah, I have, my cuticles stay red for about, until tomorrow, and then they won't be red anymore. But this is uh, what I did. And you can see, if I can get it to focus, I put those green, focus, green um, dolphins, if I can get my camera to focus, you can see the little green dolphins and then the little circles that I put in the mix. Those are so stinking cute with the dolphins. I don't know if you can see those with this mix that I use, the Seafoam Breeze. And now maybe you can see it a little better. When I did the video today, it was showing up super, super, super green. And it's not, it's a beautiful Seafoam. Um, the ring finger, I did the entire nail in the mix. Otherwise, the other nails, I just kind of gradiated it. But um, that is what's on my nails. And you can see the little star there. It's, I should have probably put a few more stars in here to make it so it doesn't look like a lone, well, two stars. <laughs> but anyway, that is what is on. My nails and I put the little Chanel logo. So I hope you guys like them. Um, it's they're very similar to what I've been pretty much wearing. And I do have these tips also available in my store as well. If you guys are interested in the tips, these are the C curved curled stilettos, but I made them more of an almond shape. I have uh, square tips. I also have the curved square tips so if you check out my store i'll put the link down below um but anyway i just wanted to share that with you so this is with my and this is available too in my store my um seafoam breeze that i just made today um i just absolutely love it 
So anyway, that's my nails. Yeah, they're not very blingy for New Year's, but whatever. I didn't want them to be very blingy. So there we go. That's my nails. Hope you guys enjoyed them. Hope you like them. Let me know what you think. Um, hopefully when I get situated, um, I could do some actual sit down tutorials on how I do my nails. Um, now that I got for Christmas, my husband bought me an enormous memory card. So now I don't have an excuse. So I have plenty of space to sit down and do videos, um, tutorials. So anyway, there you go. Let me know. Hope you guys like them. So I will see you all in my next video. Have a good one. Love y'all. Bye.